the the thing that I, I've always had an issue with is uh, uh is um well just because most private lenders they do up to like was it seventy five percent or so generally uh, yeah like yeah, if you find someone who's you know your your best friend or they they like you a whole lot they might just say yeah sure I trust you inherently mm. but seventy five percent is market yeah yeah so uh, with that seventy five percent like that's where that that last 25% that we're trying to rebuild back up because we kind of did sink way too, way more money than we expected to. Into this mm -hmm. first property. Now, uh, now when I say 75%, I mean 75% of ARV. So the future value of the property. Oh, I thought it was always just 75% of the purchase price. That's a, that's a really helpful distinction because when you're buying turnkey, so if you're buying something that's already in good shape and you're going to put it on a 30-year loan, then you got to put 20% down. So it's 80% LTV or 25% down with some loan programs and they fund the rest of it. Um, and now that's put on a 30-year loan, right? So you're, you're, you're setting it and forget it. This is ideal for property that's already in good shape. You don't really have to fix up. Maybe you put some lipstick on it, but you're not going to refinance it. For a Burr property, you buy properties with someone else's money, whether that's private or hard money, and they will loan you, if it's hard money, they'll loan you 90% of the purchase price and 100% of rehab up to 75% of the future value of the home. All right. So if you're buying a $40,000 house and putting $30,000 of rehab into it, you've got to show up with 10% of the purchase price. So you got to show up with four grand and then they, they fund everything else. That's hard money. With private money, they will loan generally. I mean, when you're talking with someone, you got to come up with terms. But standard is they fund 100% of purchase, 100% of rehab, up to 75% of the future value of the home. That's why it's so important that all in, your purchase plus rehab, is less than 70% of the ARV, the after repair value. So that when you actually refinance, you can pay them off and you have enough money for the purchase and rehab to be able to actually complete the entire borough process. So that's that's why it's so valuable. So that that might help you as far as you know some misconceptions about private money and what they will and won't lend. Okay, that just turned on a light bulb in my head. I uh, I see everything completely different now. But that uh, I I I always thought it was uh, the fund seventy five percent of the the purchase price, and that's why I was just like, man, I got to come up with a lot of you know down payment money. So okay, yeah. that that will change a lot.